up a treat guys welcome back to my channel so we are back with another weekly vlog so today is monday june 13th i'm just not getting my day started because your girl did work last night so if you guys don't know i do work at a club and so i worked last night and usually when i work my days don't start the next day until like around 4 p.m 5 p.m because your girl be sleeping in I didn't go to bed until like 4 a.m. last night. And, so, and by the way, I did end up getting my hair redone. You guys are always asking about hair details. So this wig is from Wig Nia. And um, I really like this hair. As you can see, it definitely holds a curl. And that's something that's very important to me because when I wear my hair, I don't like my hair to just be straight or curly. I like it to have like those big barrel curls. And so a wig that holds a curl is a must so i love that this hair holds a curl and i love the jet black look like i've just been loving jet black and see and my hairstylist did end up bleaching the knots and it looks really good it's a good density it's not too thick but it's also not too thick but whenever i curl this hair it does last me for the whole day like i'll curl my hair for work and it will last me throughout the whole day and so I really love that with this wig. It has a lot of body. It's a perfect length. Um, 24 inches. This is usually the length that I wear. I like my hair to be like boob length. And so, you guys, this wig is very luxurious. And I really love it. Look at it. Look at it. It's just so pretty, so gorgeous. Shiny black. And my, my hairstylist didn't do that much plucking on it. But as you guys can see, it definitely still looks natural. So I'm going to have the link for this hair down below if you guys want to go shop. As you guys can see, it has a lot of body. So this is what we're working with. <laughs> and of course, I had to come and do an unboxing for you guys. I know you guys saw my last vlog when I went to Mexico. And um, the guy out there bought me some Gucci, went to the Gucci store, and he got me some shoes. And I was getting, like, DMs, text messages, and all of that of you guys asking for me to do a unboxing. So, of course, we are back. And for you guys, um, this stain was from my purse because I had to... And that's the annoying part. When you buy things out the country, you have to travel home with it. And so I did have to put these shoes in my carry-on. So something did spill on the box. But you guys... These are so cute. And so we're going to do an unboxing. I haven't worn them. I haven't did anything yet. I just had them sitting um in my closet. And so let's unbox it. I'm so excited. And so these are the shoes. Now shopping in Mexico. Um, They do have a good selection. But the original Gucci sandals that I wanted, they did not have. And so because I have this white and gold bag, I wanted something that I can wear, you know, for the summertime and to match the bag. And so this is it. Of course, this is the receipt. You always got to keep the receipt. And so, you know, we went shopping in Mexico. And I'm going to tell you guys the price. Oh, when you were shopping overseas, it is definitely a bit more pricey. But because this is like a gift, you know, I'm not complaining, but... Um, these shoes cost 14,200 pesos. So when I was doing the calculations, that's a little bit over $700 these shoes came up to. Now for these shoes particular, I think um, these are the same price in the US, but they have these different styles. They have different styles of shoes that are a bit more in Mexico. So you do have to like, you know, do the calculations and everything but this is the receipt and because he was out there i'm like you know what this is not my coins if i'm getting treated and then you know i'm just going to pick out what i like and so yeah let me unbox of course of course the uh, we got the dust bag and everything so these are the sandals i ended up getting they are so cute i'm gonna go to match with my purse perfectly this is the other dust bag and so it's like white brown gold and like i said my purse is white and gold so i feel like these are really cute for the summertime and i didn't end up getting a size 39 these whenever i get sliding sandals i always go up a size just because you know like when you're walking throughout the day and your foot tends to slide back and even when i was talking to the sales um person inside the store he actually recommended because I didn't know if I should get the 38 or the 39, but after, you know, walking around and doing all of that, we decided 39 was the best. And so I'm actually 
happy that I went with this size. They are so cute for summertime. And that was like really nice of him. So we we'll unbox it for you guys. And about me, I definitely love princess treatment. And I really feel like every girl deserves princess treatment. Like do not ever settle for less, okay? And so I'm actually about to go to a yoga class today. Your girl is thinking about getting into Pilates, but the studio that I was looking into, they are completely booked for the day. So I'm like, you know what? Um, I just want to get some type of physical activity in, you know, it's my day off and I just want to, you know, tone and continue to work out and be consistent. So I'm like, you know what? Let me try yoga because I have some really good benefits of doing yoga. So we're going to do yoga this week and we're also going to do a Pilates class. So I'm super excited for that. I'm about to head out. But anyways, you guys, today we're just going to do yoga and I'm just really enjoying my day off. Your girl has to work out like crazy because I have goals that I really want to achieve. So yeah, we, we're about to put my shoulders. I got, we got the yoga mat. So I ended up finding two mats so we don't have to stop at Marshall's, but we are running a little late. So yeah, she's coming with me to yoga. Safety first. Under the shoulders, lift through the back of the heart using your back muscles in inhale to cobra. Exhale, coming down, pushing into the earth, tucking toes under, and coming back to downward dog. Inhale, the right leg behind you, up towards the sky, three-legged dog, and then, in, um, and then open your hip towards the sky, so that right hip is lifting open towards the sky. And then maybe dropping that foot behind you, so bending the right knee and letting the right foot fall towards left glute. You might even gaze under your right. shower i'm actually getting ready for work right now and the last like day or two i haven't really done much so that's why i haven't picked up the camera my face feels so ashy right now i'm actually am about to um do some of my skincare because like i said i am going to work i'm working tonight right now it's like 7 30 p.m so by the time i do my makeup and i leave the house it's probably going to be like 8 30 p.m but um the last time you guys saw me, I was at that yoga class. And so I just kind of wanted to turn the camera to talk to you guys for a little bit. I usually let this soap sit on my skin for like five minutes. I'm gonna be so real this last month or so, I have not worked as much because it was my birthday and then I went to Mexico. And then once I came back from Mexico, I had a really bad cold. So I was in the house for like a week and a half. So within the last month, I didn't work as much as I should, and it's honestly grind season for me right now. You guys know we're going through an inflation, and so right now is the time to stack because we, we might be hitting a recession soon, and so that's why I've just been trying to work as much as possible. Um, I also am starting some new business ventures, and I'm also getting into investing, so you guys are going to see all that on my channel. Right now, I'm just adding like some more soap on my face because I like it to sit on my skin. Yeah, you guys want to see more of that on my channel. I'm getting more to invest in because um, I actually make a decent amount of money because, like I said, I work night life. And so I just want to invest in more. A lot of the times I just have my money sitting in my bank account, but I'm like, it's, there's no purpose of me doing that, just having it sit where my money can be growing for me. And so 
I know a lot of people that do invest. And so I just been like talking to some people. They been giving me advice. And so, yeah, you guys are just kind of seeing me become the better version of myself. And I feel like that's what I've really been doing these last, um, like the last week and a half where I was just sitting in the house sick. I've just been like, just figuring about what makes me happy, what I want out of life, my goals. And, you know, sometimes it takes you having to just be in the house to really concentrate on yourself and see, you know, what you love, what makes you happy. A lot of you guys probably know that I did have a cosmetics line that I was running for a couple of years. Uh, I want to say I had it for like three, four years. And I honestly took a break because I rebranded. But throughout the process, um, while I was rebranding my cosmetics business, that's when I began to work at work nightlife. I started, you know, my makeup line just really wasn't making me happy no more. I think it's because I've grown so much from that. I feel like... I'm like more into fashion now and I have like other interests and so I've just been doing what makes me happy and of course I'm still going to go back into entrepreneurship but right now the goal is stacking and investing okay so um yeah I'm going to just kind of take you guys on a journey but finding yourself is definitely a journey like because I feel like we just all go through different stages in life like um me Patrika during her early 20s versus her mid 20s are completely two different people. I've just grown so much, I've experienced so much, and so I'm just ready to elevate even more and turn into the best version of myself. And so that just includes me grinding. And so anyways, let me just wash this off. Uh, I have to do my makeup, I'm gonna curl my hair. It usually takes me like an hour and a half to get ready for work because, you know, you gotta look real pretty when you're going in, okay? So anyways, let me wash. This is how I'm looking tonight. And so I'll probably see you guys either when I get off work tonight or tomorrow. See you guys later. But I just had to come back on camera. One thing I love about this hair, like I mentioned um, earlier in the vlog, it really holds a curl. So I already know my hair is going to stay curly like this the entire night. So I picked up the vlog camera in like two days because the last two days was my day off. So I honestly just used those day off to just relax and some self-care and just really chill because I've been working like crazy this last week. But today is Tuesday and your girl have a lot to do today. So I'm just nice along today's long journey. So... You guys know your girl is a very organized, so I did make a list of some things I have to do today. Um, I did wake up this morning, I did some laundry, and um, I did hand wash my faha, and so I just took it out the dryer, so I am about to put my faha back on. Now I also have to leave because I have to run some errands, I have to stop at the bank to deposit some money, and I also want to stop at... Um, this smoothie place the name is not coming to my mind right now but they have amazing smoothies and i really love that they don't like add any extra sugars it's just like a vegan restaurant or vegan yeah it's like a vegan I have a surgery consult session at 3 p.m so if you guys didn't know i created a online booking site so that you guys can book sessions with me so that i can help you with your pre-op or your post-op bbl journey so if you guys have any questions when it comes to come Depression, finding a doctor, any surgery questions, vitamins, aftercare, you know, fahas, like whatever it is that you guys need help with. If you need help with swelling, shrinking your waist, just anything at all, you guys can book a session with me. I have a session booked for today at 3 p.m. So I am going to, you know, just give you guys a little glimpse. Obviously, I cannot sh show my entire session online just for privacy reasons. But I'll, you know, like just show you guys a little bit of what I do. And so that's something that I recently, you know, just started up just to help you guys. Because I will get so many DMs from you guys, you know, asking about surgery questions, doctors. But I just feel like DMs is just not the appropriate place to, you know, actually go into details. For example... If you just got surgery and you DM me about compression, I feel like it's best that I that we do a video call so that I can actually see how you look, see the swelling. I can see what type of faha that you wear because I, I, I had um, the last surgery session that I had, I was able to see the faha that my client had and I was able to tell her that she was in the wrong stage faha. I think she had a stage one faha and it was time for her to move to stage two. So had she DM me, these are things that I would not have known. So that's why I feel like it's, you know, it's very beneficial to actually book a session. So yeah, the link is down below to book a surgery consult session with me. I also have it for like doctors, doctor lists. I'm actually building up a really good um, plastic surgery doctor list so that if you want to get not even bbl if you want to get breast implants tummy tuck all of that like i'm just gonna have the, the 
a list of the best doctors that you can go to and all of that so i have that session at 3 p.m so i'm actually gonna put on my fall we're gonna head on out so that i can run these errands so i could be back in time for my client session and so yeah this is like what tuesday is i do have some laundry in the washer i do have to wash my makeup brushes and yeah today's just gonna be a very productive tuesday so yeah let me just put this on and we are going to head out so up in your room once again tempted bad for me it's the truth but i can't miss this don't tell my friends that i'm here this is don't tell my friends that i'm Perfect. You have to bring my thing for a while. Here. Take this one. I brought my one thing. I this thing looks very clear when I use that. This is what I brought. I can't say I love you no more. Cause my friends gon' judge me for sure. Take the time but I feel like it. Cause the time but I feel like it. Cause the time but I feel like it. Cause the time but I feel like it. sister it was so delicious by the way i did not eat everything at all i am working on eating smaller portions and so i did save all of my food well majority of my food to eat for dinner tonight and so i do have some water here i'm back to only drinking water no liquor no juice no soda and so i have that and i had to hurry up and rush home because your girl have a surgery consult session and so i'm supposed to i'm supposed to get on my call in like 10 minutes and so how it works is i do my calls through zoom it's a video chat so i'm able to see you guys and so yeah i really had to rush home and you know your girl is not playing i'm actually am about to be six months post-op really soon so i do plan on making a updated six month bbl but look I'm not playing, baby. I'm in my faha. Like, uh-uh. Okay, so it's a little bit after 3 o'clock. I do have a second appointment at 4. So right now, I'm about to finish up some laundry and just relax 